2024 is set to be the Earth's hottest year in thousands of years, replacing 2023 as the current record. Climate change is fueling these dangerous heat waves, further supercharged by the El Niño phenomenon that began in June 2023. This intensified global warming is putting lives at risk and exacerbating existing environmental and humanitarian challenges. Asia's extreme and record-breaking heat in April and into May 2024 led to severe impacts across the Asian continent, impacting cities and remote communities in Bangladesh, India, Thailand, and Vietnam. Extreme heat can have harmful effects on human health, particularly affecting vulnerable groups, including the elderly, young people, and outdoor workers. The latest data predicts a shift from the current El Nino phase to La Nina conditions, with a more than 50% chance of La Nina developing by December 2024 through February 2025. This shift will likely result in wetter and cooler conditions compared to El Nino's heat waves. Scientists explain that these new conditions are likely temporary and will not counteract the overall trend of extreme and intensifying planetary-scale heating. The past 10 years have been the warmest on record, ocean heat is rising, and extreme weather and climate events have led to massive economic and human losses. La Niña winter weather forecast is tied to its significant weather disruptions for regions in Asia, including typhoons and flooding. Rising temperatures caused by climate change mean periods of La Niña can remain as hot as historical periods of El Niño. This additional heat in air and water is supercharging certain weather disasters such as Super Typhoon Yagi, Asia's most powerful storm of 2024. Governments, NGOs, and local communities must work together to build resilience against uncertain and volatile weather patterns. The Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change IPCC, highlights that climate-related disasters and extreme weather events are worsening more quickly than scientists originally predicted. Communities worldwide are already suffering from a cascade of damage to livelihoods, food and water security, infrastructure, and essential services, 